It's summer 2011 and I had the privilege of catching up with these students on Plymouth Howe skating. Didn't get really a lot yesterday, so I'm trying to uh, get a bit more into it today. Yeah, um, what we're going to go is right. a bit, do a bit of jumping off the stairs. Oh, you've got to watch out for the security because they get a bit paranoid. Do they? Yeah, they, um, some, some to buy. Sorry? How much do they cost to buy? To rent one? Uh, to, uh, to buy. To buy, are they about £250 maybe? Yeah. I'm not sure. I'm going to buy a Cameron. And you're a student at the university as well, are you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So what are you studying? Um, international business. And where do you come from? Uh, Jersey, Channel Islands. Uh -huh. How long have you been in Jersey? Um, ten years. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So where, where are you hoping to go when you finish in Plymouth? Um, well, I'm moving up to London because I've set my own business up. And uh, so I'm going to stay there for a bit until it grows. Right, thanks a lot. Yeah. You've got two types of boots, what are they for? So yeah. Both are, um, well, yeah, these are speed skates and also for doing the cones and these are for jumping and grinding so these are more aggressive skates How long have you been doing the outdoor activity? Um, what do they call it exactly? Well, they call it inline skating Right Yeah, so I've been doing it for about five years Yeah Yeah, yeah, and uh, he's been doing it for two years Ah, so you started in Jersey? I started in Jersey, yeah And you started in London? Um, yes, I've started in London. Uh, well, I started as a kid back in Poland, but then stopped and got back into in London. So, where it's more popular than down here, yeah. Plymouth. It's catching on. Yeah, hopefully. hopefully. The, uh, the student uh, culture is going to bring it all in, I think. Yeah, that's what we try to do, get as many people as we can, you know, because it's so much fun yeah. to do this. Better than walking.
That's what the training's all about. Sorry? That's what the training's all about. Yeah. So she did videos. No, you didn't like it. No, I specialised to learn. Yeah, yeah I know. Like, yeah, it's fantastic. Biggest, it doesn't matter if you can't stop. Biggest star ever. It doesn't matter if you can't stop, I know. But What's your name? Marcus. How long have you been sure. rollerblading? No well, so I started blading when I was like 13, 14. Yeah. And then, uh, you know, used to play street hockey. Uh, and then, you know, school, girlfriends, university got in the way. Um, and then moved well, back to Plymouth. Your, we're not uh, down yeah. very often. Move, so moved to university here. Uh, um, and uh, yeah, this is just, you know, it's the best place to skate I've, I've seen in yeah, anywhere, really. It's a massive expanse of town, mate. I thought I'd get myself some blades and get fit. And, uh, how, long have you, have, how long have you been rollerblading? Uh, well, in, in Plymouth, uh, probably, what was it? I probably started in 2000, about 2009, I started blading, but on and off. Um, I work overseas, uh, so 
sometimes I can't blade for a while. Uh -huh. uh, but yeah, no, it's, uh, you know, just on and off, self-taught. Right, cheers, thanks a lot. Right. When you're ready. Yeah, so we're basically trying to launch skating as um, a sort of fashion and a sort of thing to do. You know, it's a good sport and keeps you fit. So what we're trying to do is get loads of people in one group of skating. We're using Facebook to do that. And then um, we're just organising loads of events and stuff. And then um, soon I'm going to introduce like a skate brand to sort of establish the group. And that's basically it. From now on, it's fun. You're going to make your own clothes or, or yeah, your yeah. own brands in? Um, we've, we've got a plan to make some t-shirts. Yeah. So yeah, um, we're just designing those and coming up with a name at the moment. Uh, so, what yeah. Facebook page will they be on? Um, you can find us on Late Night Skate on uh, Facebook, that's the group. Yes. And so um, in about a month's time you'll find the t-shirts there as well. And what do Late Night Skates do? Uh, well, late night skate, we just go out skating late at night, night yeah. <laughs> so that's basically it, really, yeah. Okay, thanks very much. Cheers. Oh, you've got to watch out for the security because they get a bit paranoid. Do they? Yeah, they um, some some to buy. Sorry. How much do they cost to buy? To rent one. Uh, to, uh, to buy. To buy. Are they about fifty pounds maybe? Yeah. I'm quite sure. Don't know friends have been.
What's your name? Cameron. And you're a student at the university as well, are you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So what are you studying? Um, international business. And where do you come from? Uh, Jersey, Channel Islands. Uh -huh. This has been a Chris Summerfield uh, media production. Tennis. You can contact me, sponsor me and support yeah, yeah. me through PayPal at ChristopherSummerfield at gmail.com. Thanks for watching the video. I've set my own business up and uh, so I'm going to stay there for a bit until it grows. Right, thanks a lot. Yeah. You've got two types of boots, what are they for? So yeah, those are, um, where are they? Yeah, these are speed skates and also for doing the cones and these are for jumping and grinding. So these are more aggressive skates. How long have you been doing the outdoor activity? Um, 